Hey, this is Nellie's Farm. It's October 12th, 2024. It is a beautiful autumn day here in northeast Alabama. I want to bring you a story that's breaking right now and it's very important. Hope you're having a good weekend too. Well, oh yeah, I gotta show you guys my baby figs for my baby fig tree. I didn't know that it would grow figs being a baby in the container. Now I've been meaning to plant this fig tree for a few years to be honest and I just haven't figured out where to put it yet. Now these, these are morning, morning glory seeds but the figs are right here, the bigger ones. This is my first and only fig tree. I'm new to this so I'm not sure if I should leave it in the pot for the winter or should I uh, plant it now. If anyone knows anything about fig trees and they have some good advice to give me, I really would appreciate that. But anyway, imagine my excitement when I saw those after it sitting in a pot for a few years. <laughs> well, we've got some major developments uh, in the financial world. Bricks which you know from my previous videos. BRICS is the organization, sorry, my dog's interrupting me. Uh, Brazil, Russia, China, India. It's the, it's the big financial system that is competing now with the U.S. dollar in 159 countries. Hey, Peps. Here's Pepper. 159 countries were in BRICS, um, the last I heard. So, but India is, um, is almost number one in population, if you didn't know that. They're almost surpassing China now in population. And they have a, a super large economy. So, because Russia and China and BRICS invited recently Pakistan into the fold, they're not happy about it. They are not happy about it at all. Now, they are refusing to follow the de-dollarization agenda which is BRICS goal, of course, uh, and uh, to isolate the U.S. dollar <laughs> and take up the world economy. Because India and Pakistan have been enemies many years. And uh, so India is siding with America right now against fellow BRICS nations, even though they're in it. After that Pakistan invitation, their foreign minister, and I'm not going to try to say his name because I'll butcher it, <laughs> said India will not target the U.S. dollar and only use local currencies when it makes sense. This decision puts India at odds, of course, with Russia and China and the other members who are leading the way in the push to abandon the U.S. dollar. Inside sources say one of the concerns of India is because China is its growing control over BRICS within the group. So it sounds like they're trying to dominate it. Now, about that, I believe that China is going to be the head of the one world government. I have watched uh, certain events take place for years now that indicate that. For one, the elites are all teaching their children Mandarin. They all, they, including Ivanka and, uh, all of the elites are doing this for a reason. And I'm sure you've heard the rumors of the Chinese pouring in to the United States. So, um, all sides are pretty much lining up into their final positions for World War III, in my opinion. And by the way, um, someone commented they're not surprised when I read this news story because Britain has um, controlled, you know, India for a long time. Now, take that for what it's worth, and it, it, it is true. I don't know how, you know, and of course, Britain is on our um, America side, the so-called allies. So, I wanted to bring you this story. It's important, and I got one more to do for sure today. I'll try to get more done, but at least one more important one, and I'm still doing my fundraiser which is absolutely necessary because if it was not, I wouldn't even ask. It's very hard for me to do this. 
I'm very independent and I always have been. But I'm going to put my PayPal link in the description box. And I thank you for watching. Please share my videos. And please don't forget to hit the thumbs up button. Because a lot of people don't do it. The, the thumbs up don't even come close to um, the amount of views. Because it does help. And um, it looks like they're not sharing my videos. Like promoting it. Um, they were promoting my shorts. But it doesn't appear they are now. So I'm sure you know that would help me out. And I don't get any funding from YouTube at all. Thank you for watching. And like I said, I hope you're having a great weekend with good weather. Nellie's Farm signing off.